Hello, my name is Mordred Viking, and I'd like to welcome you to this episode of Patrician 3, where I'm joined by Mr. Wust and Satalia. Hello. Hello. So, um, how much can I buy your companies for? <laughs> um, well, if you've got 6.6 .6 million, yeah, that's that's yours. I have that somewhere in under the sofa or something. <laughs> can I give you an IOU? Uh, no. Oh. <laughs> Too bad. <laughs> I mean, nice try and all, but... <laughs> I had to try. Mm. had to do something. Come on. We yeah, are still on slow Yeah, we're still on slow down. have been feeling the poor for ages, and it's just... Okay, wait, no, my production is actually going up, so that's good. And the numbers are also going up. We're being repaired. I should have more skins here again. I do. Oh. Is that you? That was you. Holy shit, that's a lot of wine you're bringing. Leave some behind, please. Who? Oh, what? Oh, um, my hub uh, trade just picked up 200 wine from Hamburg. Ah. Leaving none in Hamburg. I was like, oh, <clears throat> quick manual <laughs> intercept. Leave some wine in Hamburg because uh, they are thirsty too. Okay, let's see. I got wine, whale oil, grain, beer, leather, and pottery again. Okay. What can I bring from here? Currently have 15 beggars in town. My hawk has appeared. Now I'm gonna kick out 58. Dismiss sailors. Now I have 73 beggars in town. That's awesome. I have a job for you. Why not? There we go. Oh, not enough beggars in town again. Well... Yeah, that tends to be quite a theme in this game. Hmm. <laughs> certainly seems to have been, yes. So I now have eight half-timbered houses for 2,240 citizens. Four gabbled for 560, and three merchant's houses for 240. And there's another merchant house in the building. So... I am gonna need more merchant's housing. Clearly. That's more like it. Cold Rage just anchored in Lubeck, 128,000. Oh, wow. Nice. And another Gebelt. Yep, seems I can only build on the north side of the first road. Which is really weird. Yeah. Hmm. It's gonna be tricky. Oh well. Take forever. Oh, I ain't got enough people for that. I see. You're still pissed, right? Yeah. 
Ooh. 16, uh, 96,000 uh, profit. Nice. Very nice. Will you sail again? 800 beer on the way to Visby. There we nice. go. You will sail again. Okay, got the Scarborough. 23 beggars there. I'll take them. Yeah, I'm gonna leech beggars from everywhere. <laughs> no seed. Completion of what? A cabot house is ready. That's good. I didn't realize you can start building stuff even when your trading office is not ready yet. Yes, you can. You can. You can. I've done that a few times. Right, let's employ an administrator in Bergen, even though it's just for the honey. Trading um, office, sell the honey. Oof, that's not. <laughs> I was gonna buy more bricks in Bergen, but there were 219 each, so. No. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, that's a nice amount. Bring that to Hamburg, please. Short sail from Scarborough to Newcastle. You could have walked that, but I'll just prefer to uh, sail you over. <laughs> I do have automatic trade there, don't I? Yes. Oh wow. Mm -hmm. One of my fleets managed to pick up 63 skins somewhere. Nice. Ooh. Oh poor Ravehall. Yeah, I only lost one uh, skin place there. One hunting lodge. It wasn't Riga as bad as it could have been. No. Riga needs bricks. Like a lot of them. Yep. They are building a wall after all. Yeah, they are. Wait, that's not mine. Oh. You have... Uh -huh. Right. Can we now continue? For a bit at least. There we go. Ten more pieces of wall in Hamburg. It's a start. I think I'm having a bit of the same problem as Mordred in a way that I'm building so much that my cash flow is pretty much 
constant, or seems constant. Oh. I mean, my bank, I should say. Well, it's before taxes, right? Yeah. Yeah. Right, another 58. Dismissed. Oh, they really hate me for that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care, though, but form a unit. Town watch, form a unit. No? Oh. Apparently, I don't have the goods for that. Ships, hands weapons. I do have 10 in the office. Am I not allowed more town watch? Oh. Oh, well, that would have been too easy then, huh? Shortage of dwellings. I wonder why. Ah, merchants' houses. Yeah. And this one is done when? Today. There we go, completion. No more shortage of dwellings. More rich people in the town. I'm already at 1900, so it's getting there. Good. Yep. Now, this one is finished? Yes. Why are you stopped? Oh, there's another pirate. Just outside of Malmö. Are you... huh? Once my explorers are repaired, I might send them off. Ah, oh, they're repaired. I'm confused. I have four workshops outside of Newcastle. Yet, if I click on the last one I built, it says businesses of this type 3. So, either it's not officially built yet... Oh, there we go. Right, so it's just just a matter of patience. Okay, fine. Yep. Six hundred beggars in town. Hmm. Oh, we're losing now. Should be good on gabbled for a half time for a bit. Still built one extra. Did you say you went east of Tunis to the west? Uh, from Tunis to the east, south down the coast. Yeah, go west. So Libya. Yeah. All right, I'm going west. Yeah, I got my expedition filling the holes in some places. Feels weird sending them without any cargo, but I can't afford it right now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm just thinking. The guys I've now sent off to Edinburgh to pick up more sailors to turn into beggars. They look skeptical at least. They're halfway between normally happy and extremely pissed. <laughs> I'm wondering if it's the same 12 who keep sailing back and forth. <laughs> Could be. Like, hey, we got a job for you. And then we come into Newcastle. Yeah, this was the job. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Best part is, they keep falling for it. <laughs> <laughs> Every single time. Every single time, indeed. Right, okay, back to Newcastle. Um, how much honey am I producing now? 88.9. That's decent. Let's do some more. Revals gates just fell. They're in. 
Well, at least that means production will be back up soon. Yeah. So much hemp here. Not a lot of fish, though. Ooh, you actually need salt. I guess they missed. Well, I'm slowly approaching the 2.8 million. Searcher has returned from a convoy. No new trading centers could be made accessible. Okay. Dock in Bruges, please. Right. Another round of firing sailors. Maybe okay. the AKA slave trade. Congratulations. Well, thank you. Congratulations indeed. Oh, yeah, you needed that. Bloody hell. I accidentally sent one of my ships off to Edinburgh, even though I was actually supposed to go to Newcastle. Eh. <laughs> oh hey, you're both here. Max Dimpet. What? Pirates thinks he's attacking me? No, 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 no. I'm attacking you. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get this straight, boys. <clears throat> <laughs> yeah, he ran away. <laughs> of course he did. Uh, fishery. Fisherman's house, there we go. One is good enough. Okay, so I'm producing uh, 21 iron goods in Lubeck each week. That's not bad. Well, it is quite uh, little, to be honest. Oh, yeah, compared to my 86 in Newcastle, yes. Wait, did Ravel win? What? Because they've got a bunch of soldiers marching back in from the side of the map. Oh, maybe they did. Kind of looks like they did. Yeah, otherwise there would have been soldiers inside the town looting yeah. the place. Interesting. That's good. Ah, another cattle farm. Ah, screw it, I'm gonna burn this place down and cost me money. Right, my wage is currently at 175 a week. 147. Well, you did just pull, tear down a few businesses, right? Yeah. You could have sold businesses, by the way. Oh. Uh, yeah, you can... Uh, I don't know where you were breaking the businesses down. I'm uh, just clicking on the business. Yeah, I know, but where? Which city? Reval. Uh, if you need to lose more... <clears throat> not sure which one you're trying to break down at the moment. Well, I'm not going to do any more. I'm, I'm down to what I want it to be. Ah, okay. I was going to say, if you click on the building... <clears throat> you also have the. Um... Oh, I don't have any buildings here, so I can't. 
quite. Yeah, there is another icon next to demolish, but just grayed out. Yeah. Oh no, you need to be part of the guild in said city oh. to be able to do that. I'm not. Which, by the way, is probably a good idea to start joining guilds. There we go. So what what does being in the guild actually do? Because it's super expensive. Um, it allows you to buy buildings from others and also ships. There's an auctions button. Oh. So, say you want to sell sh uh, buildings in a certain city and you are part of the guild, you can actually um, put the building up for auction and then everybody will um, be able to uh, bid on the buildings. Okay, gotcha. And that can be quite hectic. <laughs> right, you go to there. You go back to Groningen. And you... are completely happy again and oblivious to what I've done before. So I'll <laughs> send you to London this time. 90 beggars in London. I'll take them. How's Newcastle doing? 2000. Good. Yes, I know the town wall is too small. I have half a year left, I think. Uh, Possibly. Just found I had 400 timber in Malmo. Wow. I'm selling this at a horrible loss. But I don't want to pay for the warehouses. So if you need timber, there's a whole bunch in Malmo. Well, right, speaker, I don't really need timber. I got maybe 50, 100 timber scattered around my warehouses. <laughs> and it takes up quite a bit of space as well. Oh, yeah. Um, I was going to check something, but I can't do that in Hamburg. No, I need to go to Lubeck for that. Lubeck, Alderman's office. I have till September 4, 1420. Okay. Good. So I need another 1,300 people in this city. Huh. 9... 29.40... Another half timber is being built, another gabbled is being built, and another... Merchant's house is being built. That's looking up. How are my finances here? Last month. Still making money. Good. Well, that's always nice. Yes, it really is. <clears throat> oh, I've got a lot of bricks. You know what? I am going to build more apiaries. For the simple reason that honey can always be sold in the med. True. Okay, there we go. Right, hello London sailors slash beggars. Are they going for an adventure? Oh yes, very short-lived adventure, but an adventure nonetheless. Fair enough. Why is you not selected? There we go. Um, 
13 days. No building slots free. Fine. May have to wait with dumping backers for a bit because there's nothing uh, currently finished with which takes citizens. So. Ah. You are in Reaper, that is good. Let's see, got me some leather and meat, the pig iron too. Oh wow, you got quite extensive uh, meat farms in uh, Reaper. Actually, it's not that extensive, I need more. <laughs> well, it is still eight. It is eight, yes. But considering they. altogether, these eight produce. Uh, 12.9 meat and 51 leather. Yeah, I have six in Malmo. It's a similar thing. Need more. Mm -hmm. Yeah, everything I bring to Hamburg is being eaten and worn and used and... Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough, I guess. And I'm almost out of skins again in Hamburg as well. I don't know why, but they, those babies still fly away. Yeah, that they do. To be fair, I am at 60, uh, 6,800 inhabitants in Hamburg, so it does fly up. Uh, Gabalt merchants. I am building a merchant's house, am I not? Oh, wait, it just finished. It's a Gabalt. Hmm. Ninety-three. Don't have the bricks for that, of course not. Well, Groningen is producing bricks enough now, that's good. Yeah, the town is producing quite a bit of bricks. I got, I think, three places producing it, you got, what, eight? Uh, total, yes. And with <coughs> just enough uh, wood production to cover it. We are slightly short on people here, but that's not too bad. Yeah, there's um, only a few missing. It's a light yellow color, so it's not too bad at all. Yeah, there is no leather in Hamburg whatsoever, so that's painful. But Newcastle also needs it. Right, let's see. Um, I guess I'll go and keep going east from what has already been discovered. Oh no, towards Lothbrook's under attack. Oh dear. Oh my. And all of the skin places held by that random AI are being destroyed. <laughs> like, the princes up here just have a thing against skin production. They, they don't want the furs being sold. Yeah. Oh god. Yeah, that's uh... Yeah, you... Novgorod is not in a good place today. <laughs> How are we on time? Oh, we are actually over time. <laughs> well, in that case, thank you everyone for watching. I do hope you've enjoyed this. If you have, then be sure to hit that subscribe button so that you get notifications when we do more of this content in the future. If you really enjoyed this, then do consider checking out our patrons, which you can find linked in the descriptions below. If you haven't already done so, then do check out the other perspectives so you can see how people actually competent at this game do it, um, rather than me, who is not. That's a thank you from me and from us and from Zitalia, and we'll catch you guys next time. Goodbye. Bye-bye.